Unfortunately, contraband, like any other illegal activity, is very difficult to control. We have we 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 have done a survey of the different markets. We have uh, we've been looking at the different stores, um, and we have not been able to. Or we haven't seen, for instance, uh, contraband carrots out there. I, I'm pretty sure there is, but we haven't seen it. It's like like I said, any, any illegal activity is not out there for you to see. Um, and whilst they, I mean, they might, um, there are many allegations and many stuff. If you don't have the evidence and the proof, you can't do anything about it. Uh, and so that is, it's, it's a very difficult situation. Um, we have, we are um, activating once again the interdiction team, which is a, a, a task force where we have Baja, customs, police, um, ministry. Supplies control everybody in the in that task force to, to start well to, to to continue and to hype up probably the the, the to increase activities um, in terms of looking at it. Um, we will we will monitor more the 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 northern border because there again there are allegations that a lot of it is coming through the to the non through the or formal um, importation point, which in this case will be the northern border. They're claiming that it's not across or through the river. And again, knowing that um, that there is uh, a lot of activity right now on the river, both from Mexican uh, authorities and Belizean authorities, I know that there, it's it's there's not much activity in terms, or there's there's a reduction in illegal movement across the river.